it's April from April's Home and today I have here a very fun subscription box. I have been spotting ads for this on Instagram for quite some time as well as Facebook and because I love Scottish culture I thought that I would check out the Wee Box. I thought I would subscribe to it for a little while and see how I liked it. Um, it is definitely getting close to Highland Game season. I attend the Portland Scottish Highland Games every single year um, for over 20 years now, and I just love it. Part of my family is Scottish, so again, I really love the Scottish culture, and I thought that this would be a really neat way to check out some of the fun items from Scotland. And I'm always tempted when I see all their Instagram pictures, so I thought I would check this out. Out. This again is Wee Box. It says a wee minding from Scotland and it comes all the way from Scotland so it takes a little while to get here um, but not too long actually. I was really surprised how quick it came. It says Wee Box Scottish Discoveries delivered to your door. It says be transported back in time with Wee Box and um, Diana, I think it's Gabaldon's Outlander books this month. So this month's box is Outlander themed. Um, the Outlander books, which I have not read yet, um, but seem like they'd be really interesting. I have seen the first few episodes of the show, and um, it says clans, tartans, and tweeds, and ancient recipes, and of course castles. Delve into the history and romance of Scotland wherever you are in the world. Pride, surprise, and laugh. And it says here, Outlander inspired wee box. So that is this month's theme, the Outlander themed wee box. So it seems like it'll be kind of fun here. I will wait to read this until we open it up. This is sort of a description of everything we will find inside. And let's see if this says anything here. It says, welcome to the wee box clan. We are over the moon to share a wee piece of glorious Scotland delivered to your door. Each month prepare for a magical Scottish experience to connect you with our bonnie shores with luxury gifts worth 50 pounds or more, often exclusive to Scotland. Your wee box is carefully curated every month to make you feel proud, surprised, and give you a wee grin. Um, let's see, and you can check them out on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram at Inside a Wee Box. So that's pretty cool. It looks like there's some contests here. Um, so let's go ahead and check this out here. I'm really excited to see what is in this box. Okay, so the first thing here it says is unbox your Scottish happiness, surprise you, fill you with pride, give you a wee grin, and thank you for being part of the Wee Box Clan. And then it is wrapped in paper here, and I think I read somewhere that this is part of a Scottish newspaper. Let's see if that is the case. Yes, it looks like it might be. It is the Falkirk Herald newspaper, so that's really exciting to look through. I love looking through um, foreign newspapers. I've run across um, foreign newspapers before um, in eBay purchases that I make from overseas, so that'll definitely be fun. So here's the little WB sticker for Wee Box. I'm going to try to peel that carefully so I don't destroy the paper. And let's see, ooh, this is our first item. Oh, this is beautiful. I absolutely love plaids, so this is, wow, that is beautiful. Let's see, a gift from Earth Squared Edinburgh. And let's see, and, and I do apologize to any of my Scottish viewers if I am pronouncing things wrong. Um, I apologize uh, for that. Wow, this is absolutely gorgeous. I will get a ton of use out of this. This makes me really happy. I was worried that a lot of the items in here being Outlander themed might be things that you know, are more of like just for fans of the show and not necessarily usable. But this is just straight up beautiful plaid coin purse here, and I will definitely use that. Let me read the description about this one. Okay, so this is based on Claire's traditional tweed. Outlander is inspiring innovative Scottish designers to breathe new life into Scotland's heritage fabrics based in North Berwick near Edinburgh. Um, Earth Squared brings you this Bonnie Tweed purse. Which one did you get? And I got this one, and it is wonderful. I love this plaid. I um, also have a plaid of my own, a tartan plaid of my own. I come from the Robertson um, clan, and I love our plaid as well. This one is so pretty, though. I love that beautiful green there with the pretty purple and pink. That's just beautiful. Okay, so let's get into the next item here. Okay, a big heavy jar here. Okay, 
see what this is. Ooh, it looks like some pre preserves or jam. So it says Pipsqueak Preserves exclusively for Weebox Phoebe's Traditional Bramble Jam. So it is uh, blackberry jam, which I love blackberry jam. Actually, we here in Oregon have quite a lovely harvest of blackberries every year. You can get them wild just uh, on various walking trails and uh, they just grow everywhere. So this will be delicious. I will definitely have to try this out. Let's see. It says Diana Gabaldins. Again, I don't know if I'm saying her last name correctly. The Fiery Cross brought us inspiration to create this exclusive bramble jam handcrafted by Pipsqueak Preserves. The bramble or smear do was much valued by old Highlanders, and this old-fashioned jam is pretty close to what Phoebe Sherston would have brought to the battlefield at all mance. Enjoy and take a step back in time. So this is must be on an episode uh, future into the show here, so that'll be really interesting to see. I love uh, jams and preserves on toast with tea. It's one of my favorite things to have for breakfast, so this will definitely be a very, very fun one to try out. Okay, and then the next item here, let's see. Oh, and this looks like it is a voucher for Earth Squared, perhaps uh, the little bag that we got here. Yeah, this is the Earth Squared brand, so it looks like you can enjoy uh, more of their items. Oh, and this is really fun here. I'm very familiar with these little clan books. I, of course, have one of my own um, for my clan, Robertson. And this is a little clan book about Clan Fraser and their place in history. These little clan books are always really fun to read. It kind of gives a history of the clan. It shares their little motto here and their um, clan badge and crest, I should say and their territory. It looks like their motto is, all my hope is in God. That's really nice. And just some historical information about them. So that's really neat. I've never read another clan uh, book besides my own, so I'll definitely have to look through this one. That's pretty fun. So it says, enjoy the stirring story of Clan Fraser from the beginnings in the midst of Caledonian um, history with this Bonnie Wee book. Fraser's of Lovat, Jamie Fraser's clan in Outlander was in fact a junior branch of the clan Fraser. Um, it was during the 14th century when clan Fraser split into two separate clans, the Lowland Frasers of uh, Philorth and the Frasers of Lovat, which are today recognized as two separate clans with a common ancestry. So that is pretty fun. Okay, that is neat. And let's check out the other item here. So we have a little bag here. Let's see what's inside this. Probably a little jewelry or something. Okay, and let's see. Oh, this is really useful. It looks like a little bookmark with a beautiful little key. A little purple gem there. Let's see. Take me home to Lallybrock. And let's see what it says about this here. So it says, handcrafted within a hair's breadth of Lallybrock, Midhope Mid Castle, we bring you this stunning bookmark of amethyst gemstone and black crystals which surround the key to Lallybrock. Um, so that is really pretty. Cute little crystals there, and I love little um, tiny bookmarks like that. I always read, I'm a, a big reader, and so this again will be a very nice little thing to have. And then we've got some more newspaper I'll have to uncrumple later and look at. And then lastly, we've got this item here. And this was an item that I saw a sneak peek of. They do have little sneak peeks online. This says, I think it's Dune Castle. Again, I'm, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. Um, but the castle that is from the Outlander show. And it says, Wee Box on the bag and Brave here. So a nice little um, muslin bag here with uh, little handles here, just nice for groceries and shopping and things like that. So that's really handy. Let's see what it says about that. It says, own your own wee piece of Dune Castle or Castle Leoc. This Bonnie cotton bag bearing the stunning medieval stronghold was designed exclusively for wee box by Brave Scottish Gifts. So a very fun little bag here. Those are always useful. I have a nice collection of these that I love to um, grab to carry things. Um, when I go grocery shopping or out and about. So that is really fun. Again, also, it's so neat that they packed it in paper um, that comes from Scotland. I'll definitely have to read that. And again, we got the bag, the jam, the little uh, clan book about clan freezer, and the bookmark, and then my most favorite item, this beautiful little coin purse here 
that I will definitely get a lot of use out of. So that was really, really super fun. I definitely enjoyed checking out the Wii box. And I'm also excited to get next month's. I've already been seeing sneak peeks of some very adorable Highland cattle, which I think Highland cattle are actually very... Um, beautiful cows. I also live in an area where a lot of cattle are raised and also in a small town right here in Oregon where I live there is a, a rancher who actually raises Highland cattle. We got to see those last year at the Portland Scottish Highland Games so it will be so fun to open next month's box as well uh, with the Highland cow theme which I think will be super fun. So that was definitely really fun. I really enjoyed my first wee box. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at everything inside my wee box just in in case you were also curious about what the items inside a wee box actually looked like. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe for more videos from April's home. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Goodbye.